general impressions from today's wins? Um, I'm definitely really proud of my team because we worked hard through both games and our bats were really alive, which we don't always see, and so that was exciting to see everybody get on base, everyone scoring, even people stealing bases, and the defense was really clean in both games. In game one, you made the start in the circle and allowed only five hits. What do you think you had working for you out there? Um, definitely hitting my corners. Um, I usually struggle with that, but I was able to hit the outside corner, and that was getting a lot of the batters. And my changeups were working pretty well today, so I was happy with this. The offense had a dramatic explosion in both games. First, focusing on game one, everyone in the lineup, one through nine, seemed to come through offensively. Did you feel coming into this contest that the offense could be so explosive? I did, just because we've all been working really hard on our hitting, and I know that every single one of us can get on base if we're in there. And especially if one hitter starts it, I know it's just going to be a rally the whole game. Talk about what your approach was and your mindset was coming into the first game offensively. Just getting in the batter's box and doing what I know how to do. Um, I try not to overthink and just swing how I know and just believe in, my, in myself. You and Macy McIntosh really seemed to be in a groove in game one. Talk about the communication that was going on between you two and the great pitch sequences that you were able to come up with. Um, I think I always know that Macy has my back no matter what, and she always talks me up and helps me if I'm not in my uh, spots or if she knows how to fix my errors. And So just having that really helps me like boost my confidence because I know that she's back there and she'll stop whatever ball that comes to her. And she'll make me you had a career-high seven strikeouts today. How does such a dominant performance in the circle, how is that a confidence boost for you? Um, I now know that I can do that, obviously, and I think going forward, if I do get a chance to pitch again, um, I know my strengths, definitely, and hitting my corners is something that I'm going to remember because I know that it's really effective. Your teammate, Mariah Montoya, in Game 2, what did you see that she had working for her in the circle? Her change, her changeups were working really well, and her rise ball. I noticed a lot of girls were having problems with that pitch. What can you say about Mariah's performance in Game 2 in the circle that really allowed your team to bear down defensively before the offensive explosion began? Well, she was causing a lot of ground balls and pop flies, which are typically easy outs, and so just having them hit those kind of balls at us were easy to make them out. We had her back. A quick turnaround before two AMC games on Saturday against St. Louis Pharmacy. How do you hope to carry the momentum that was generated from the two wins today into tomorrow's doubleheader? Making sure to play exactly how we today and just keep 